but what is the sort of uh, false misinformation about climate change that you'll see? Well, we um, used a social media analytics tool called News Whip um, to build a query to find the climate denial articles. So we looked for words and phrases typically associated with climate denial, such as climate fraud or uh, climate and Marxist plots in the same uh, same article, and found uh, 6,983 articles over a, a six-month period. And then we looked at how many interactions they'd had on Facebook and found that 10 websites represented 70% of the interactions, the shares, the likes, the comments on social media platforms. And as the Francis Haugen revelations have revealed, um, interactions are what drive, so meaningful social interactions are what drive amplification of visibility. So these 10 websites have algorithmically optimized their content best to spread climate disinformation and we've we hope we've done a service to both facebook uh which we've said you know these websites are the biggest problem on your service but also to google which which makes sure that these websites are able to make money by placing adverts for household brands many of which are green by you know in their own brands on these websites so they are inadvertently funding the production of content that then is shared to, to sow doubt about the climate science.